Okay, let's go and rescue Tame. So, she should be in the Tower of Nido, which is pretty much just back where we came from. Um, we basically have to... I don't know if we can get there this way. It's uh, probably a dead end. But you know, never mind. All these fucking poisonous little bastard snakes. Oh yeah, I got uh, Rudo some ceramic knives, and now he is an absolute beast. There's the bridge I need to get to. To the south. That was Shore, I think it was called, the abandoned house with all of the uh, all of the scoundrels in. And then just down here will be the Tower of Nido, where Tame is located. Oh, plot twist. What if Tame is actually the leader of the scoundrels? Or she's like, become the besotted with the leader of the scoundrels and she's working for them and that's... Although saying that, uh, that makes no fucking sense. If you think about it, it really makes no sense. Why would she make her dad pay the scoundrel's money when she could have the money for herself? Maybe dynamite can open this door. Uh, could we not just, like, open it? Alright, fuck it. Dynamite. Come on, let's do this. Use. Delu uses dynamite. Yep, flee. <laughs> Jesus. Well, that worked. Right. Let's go right this time. That's probably our best bet. I'm going to pretend like I don't know where I'm going, even though I so blatantly do. I'm going this way. This is the correct way. Reindeer and cat lady. They have to follow me. It's, it's mandatory. Because da, 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 100 Misesa. That's the trick to this game. Get as rich as possible. There's nothing else to it really. Just accrue as much money as possible and then pay other people to do all the fighting for us. Which, thinking about it, is basically what the, uh, the commander of whatever the planet is called has done to us. It's like, hey, you guys. He's just like, hey, you guys. Uh, here's some money. In fact, he didn't even give us any money. Cheeky little bastard. She's like, you work for me. You've got to go and do this now. Save the planet, because I'm too lazy a fucker. I don't know. People in our position are always put through trials like this, aren't we? So fucking annoying. What about chess? A try, mate. Awesome. Not entirely convinced I need those yet, but you know, I'll take I'll take what I can get. Jesus, if you're gonna give me free medicine, I could do with some medicine myself. Actually, I'm sick. What the fuck are these things? They look like giant diseased penises. Leeches. Don't miss, Rudolph. For fuck's sake. Look at you. You're smashed in the face by semen balls from the ugly penises. Come on, Nay, finish it off. Good girl. Right. That was really just to gather some items. A try mate and some money. So then we go back to the this way, I think. Yeah, back down to the very first floor and proceed on our merry way around here somewhere. This place looks remarkably 
similar to uh, to the old abandoned house that the scoundrels were living in. Coincidence? I think not. Oh well, hopefully eventually we can just... Delu has gotten hold of 20 Masetta. 20 Masetta. Fuck you. Seriously. 20. What was the point of that? I can get 20 just by killing some flies outside the starting city. Oh well. Money's money, I suppose, isn't it? That's what she said? Wait a minute, what's down here? More stuff. Another dime eight. More free medicine. Do you get the feeling something bad might happen with all this free medicine they're giving me? I feel like I keep getting halfway through a sentence and then stopping it because I get into a random battle and I have to stop talking for the random battles because I'm trying to cut them all out. Ah, oh, what a pain. Right. Which way do I want to go? I want to go... This way, yeah. No, don't go... get in there. Little bastard. Go around the transport pad. This way? I want what's in your chest! 60 Masetta! That's still a paltry sum. That was... Fucking marvellous. What a fucking detour. 80 Masetta from those two chests. Awesome. That's what I wanted. Oh well, I don't think there's too much left now. I'm pretty sure this place only has the three floors. So, we should be good to go. Uh, let's go this way. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this place only has three floors, he says, as though he's not got a fucking map in front of him. Seriously, such a noob sometimes. Come on, team. We can do this. We can rescue the girl, save the day. She'll become our princess. We fight dildo monsters and locusts. The the biggest fucking Nay. Why are you so fucking useless these days? Look at look at Rudo. Look at Delu. Why can't you be more like them? Especially when you consider you're like level 19 now and the other's are level 10. I mean seriously. Come on, girl! Come on, you can do it. I know you can, I, be I believe in you. She is fast in a fight though, I suppose. She does always go first, which is handy if I need to heal people, I guess. She's got res, which is my healy. Wait, where am I? Oh, there's a gap. Tame! No! Dildo penis monsters again! Die, dildo penis monster! You can't st oh, stop shooting your. What the fuck was that? I beat the shit out of him. Holy hell! Rudo, Rudo, are you okay, man? No, I don't care. I, I want, I want Nay to, to heal Rudo's wounds. Good girl. And again. And again. Come on. There we go. Whew. Hello. Delu hands over letter. Tame's hands are shaking. My father has become a killer. For my sake, I must stop him. Take me to him. But there are many who hate Durham. His daughter would be an easy target. Delu puts a veil over Tame to hide her identity and takes her to see her father. That voice was terrible, it hurt my throat, and I'm never doing it again. What the hell just happened? T -t ting Tame, you're an item! 
How can I get father to mend his ways? I don't know, Tame, but we're getting out of here. We are getting out of here. Fucking pink clouds. No match for us. Well, they, they wouldn't be if you fucking... Wait. Oh, God damn it. Shit, I fucking know they hurt. This is all you're good for these days. I have no faith in you anymore. Oh wait, hang on. I definitely have everything in this dungeon. I can just use... Penis, is it? And look, I'm back at the star bit. And then, even better, I can use Ryuka. And I'm back at the beginning of the game. Which is so close to the tunnel, it's untrue. That made this a lot easier. Thank God for Rudo's techniques. I like these glowy tunnels. I kind of want to go in one of these little biodomes as well. I assume it's what they grow food in or something, maybe. Who knows? I certainly don't know. Are we ready? Are we ready for this? Let's, let's do it. What's Tame doing? I'm going to meet my father. Don't go anywhere. Hey, girl. Give me your money or I'll kill you. I have nothing to give the likes of you. What? Why, you? Holy shit! Uh. Oh my god! The room! That's your fucking daughter, you moron! Father! Killing! Team! Oh, what have I. Boom! Shit! This is just one of the many tragedies which has come to pass as the world falls into turmoil. Someone must save us. I think that someone is me. I can't believe I was reading that too slow. I didn't fucking see what it was saying. God damn it. Oh well, on the positive side, we can now make our way to the next town, I guess. I guess there's a town around here somewhere. Hello, town! Right. Where's the town? I got stuck in a forest. There's a town! And it is the town of... Doesn't tell me! Hello, Mr. Yellow Man. This town is called Opto. The Biosystems Lab is located in the southern part of this town. Oh, thank you very much, weird-voiced Yellow Man. You, Blue Man. Star Mist cures your scars, and Moon Dew revives your soul. Right, are you the the other crazy person? You're the crazy one of this of this town, I take it. Hello. I want to be a musician. I heard that there's a piano teacher in this town. Okay. Oh, glorious Mother Brain, please save us. Ah. Uh. Huh? Hello, another yellow man. The Biosystems Lab had been creating plants which grow well even in a land with very little rain. Wow, what are you? Hey, what's Mother Brain? Don't know why I gave you a normal voice when everyone else a weird voice, but never mind. I wonder when peace will return to Motor. Probably never. Well, it might do, eventually. It will do if I've got anything to say about it. I've come to learn in these games, you have to speak to everybody. <laughs> it's a necessity. You there. Say, have you heard of Star Mist and Moon Dew? They smell very good. <laughs> Alright then! Meow! We eat anything when we get really hungry. Yeah. Okay, you can say that again. You've built your shop in a stupid place. The armor shop's in an okay place. 
I feel hungry. Right. The Biosystems Lab created the monsters? That's a lie. Okay. In the basement of the Biosystems Lab, I hear there is something most important. Right, thank you, crazy old man. That's, uh... Very, very interesting. Oh, more people. Wait. How do I get to you? How do I get to that man? This is this has to be done. There must be a way to get to him. Yeah, I've already spoken to you. You there. Even if those monsters are gone, Mota has already been devastated. There's nothing we can do. Don't be like that, lady. Oh, fucking hell. Alright, before I do anything else, fuck it. I've, um... I just need to go back... Back to the town. My hometown. Because... If I go home now, we get a new team member. And I'm quite excited to see whether she wants me to change her name. Let's do this. Oh no, hang on, I've gone to completely the wrong place. Well, don't I feel stupid. This is my house, silly. There's a knock at the door. How do you do? I'm Dr. Amy Sage. I've heard that you are seeking to solve the mystery of the Biomonsters. I will be glad to assist you, although I am not much of a fighter. But I can heal wounds. Give me a new name if you wish, as a sign of closeness. What? <laughs> what is wrong with you people? No! Yeah, your name fits you well. I'm glad to have you in our group. Let's check the roster at this point, where Amy came in. Uh, reorganize. Delu, nay. Yes, I also want Amy. Awesome. Nay, you're in the wrong place. Uh, order. We want Delu, Rudo, nay, and then Amy. Awesome. Seriously though, what is wrong with these people? Why do they keep trying to get me to change their names? As a sign of closeness. That's not how that's not how it works. Hey, I've already just met you, but as a sign of closeness, please change my name for me. No, screw you, Amy. You can be called Amy for the rest of your fucking life. Right, and with that, we move onwards and upwards. <laughs>